Welcome to Chef Matter D. I'm back. You know, I love summertime. It's sunny, it's beautiful out, it's gorgeous. I get to go on the pool in my floaties. But then there's also ants. They like to come inside and stay because it's warm and not humid. Well, I got one way to deal with that. Today, our recipe, ants on a log. This is a simple and fun recipe that you can do. There are four ingredients that you need. Celery, cream cheese, peanut butter, and dried cranberries or raisins. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to rinse off our celery in the sink. This is very simple. There are four ingredients you need. Celery. Cream cheese. I got it. Peanut butter. Dried cranberries. So I got two stalks of celery here. And I'm going to wash them. So first, we're going to wash our celery. And then, if you use a whole stalk of giant stalk of celery, then you would break it apart. But I already broke this part, so I already did that step. Alright, next we're going to cut the ends off the celery. Make sure that you have your parents' permission and you do it with their supervision. Now, you're going to cut the celery into pieces. So, I'm going to cut it into thirds. I got three celery sticks there. Three there. So now I got six celery sticks. Well, even life length, roughly. So our next step is the cream cheese. Then I got a knife. But first, I'm going to put these up so that the side that is open is looking up in the air. That's what I want to spread my cream cheese and peanut butter into. So, I'm going to start with this little one. You're going to use a butter knife. Make sure to spread the cream cheese in there. Okay. Okay. You can take the rest of the excess cream cheese off if you got too much. And we're going to put it into the next one. You don't need a whole lot, so probably the amount of cream cheese that I got is going to fit all three. And I'm alternating them. It's become a little bit messy, that's okay. The wider ones are going to be easier to spread the cream cheese. Alright, so now we got the cream cheese. Now we're going to take a different knife. We're going to take the peanut butter. And it's not, hopefully it's dense as the cream cheese, so it should be a little bit easier. As you can see, with the smaller pieces, it's a little bit harder. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on this big one first. Now, if you're allergic to peanut butter, you can use sun butter. That's a great alternative. Okay. 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 Peanut butter and celery is such a great snack together. Never had cream cheese, but I kind of imagine it might be like the earlier recipe of the pumpkin and French toast that we did. I'm going to get a plate, and I'm going to put on my snack next to, I'm going to alternate so that you have cream cheese, peanut butter, cream cheese, peanut butter, cream cheese, peanut butter, in a circle. Now, 
for our final step, we gotta get some ants. So, our final step, now that we've arranged everything very pretty, we're gonna get some ants. So I got some dried and sweet cranberries. Open them up. And now we're about to have an ant invasion. So, I'm gonna try to delicately put them on there and stick them in the cream cheese and the peanut butter. Look at that. Mmm. We got some ants invading our logs. If you have smaller pieces of celery, you can get smaller cranberries so that they'll fit on the log. They don't look like this one that's about to fall off. And look at that. Ants on a log. And of course, one of the most important steps. The taste test. Mm. 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 Nice, delicious. The cream cheese really kind of helps break the sweetness between the celery and the cream cheese. I'm going to try a little bit of peanut butter. Get out of the pear. Mmm. Delicious with the peanut butter, too. And peanut butter, you get that nice little peanut butter taste. Delicious. Well, that's all the time I have. I'm going to go exterminate the rest of my ants on a log. But I'll see you. Same time. Same place. Cooking with Chef Saturday. <laughs>